What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This one is going to be just a little bit different from things that I've done in the past. Um, we are going to be drawing from memory a bunch of NHL logos. Now full disclosure, I am absolutely trash at art, okay? I've never once at any point in my life been good at it. So go easy on me in the comments. It's harder than it looks. Trust me, I'm gonna show you just how hard it is. If you're excited, drop a like on the video. This is gonna be ugly. So what I think we're gonna do is draw teams by division. So in this video, we're gonna start with the Atlantic division and then the next three videos, obviously we'll cover the rest, but I'm not gonna be able to, you know, look uh, at any of their logos. It's just gonna be straight from my memory and then I'm gonna compare afterwards and see how close I was, all right? So <sighs> let's try. I'm thinking we start off easy. We start off with the Toronto Maple Leafs, the team that I've grown up watching, my hometown team. It's pretty simple, it's just a leaf. Except they changed it to the new one, which is more complex. You know, let's just go. Okay, oh gosh, so where do I, where do I start here? You know, in my head, I'm thinking about the old logo. The old, more simpler, straighter lines logo. This, this is not gonna be good, okay, let's go. It kind of helps that this has a grid. I don't know if you guys can see, but could help me at least keep things symmetrical. The first line is the most important. First face off of a game is most important. The first line in any drawing is the most important. Let's get into it here. So. Okay, okay. Oh, what am I drawing, a Christmas tree? Uh... Oh, heavens, this is ugly. <gasps> Yo, my right side's kind of okay. The left side is just all over the place. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna go for it. Bam. Bam, we're gonna come around. This is 100% a Christmas tree. A little curvature on that, I'm gonna say. This looks more like one of their older logos, definitely not their current one. Um, okay, and now I know they've got the little little stems here. I think, what, there's 13, I wanna say? I'll do 13 points and 13 stems, because I know one of them denotes how many cups they've won in their team history, which is 13. So let's just go with that. Hold on, where, where am I gonna put the text? Toronto, Maple, Leafs. Hey, that was actually, yo, that's not terrible. I know it's not proportional, but that, that's, that's a good effort. I'd give it, I'd give it a six out of 10. Maybe I'm being generous here, but I'll, I'll go with the six. All right, guaranteed though, things only get worse from here. All right, let's go with the next original six team in the Atlantic division, the Montreal Canadien. Thinking about it now, this is probably one of the easier ones. A little squeak there. I'll set that ground rule right now. We're not allowed to erase. Okay, 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 I like that. I don't even know if these little accents are, you know what, they are. Looking at it now, oh my. Actually, this kind of looks like more like the Chicago Bears logo. Oh no, 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 it's gonna be a huge H. Uh, I just remembered, okay, hold on. I have to make these little nicks here for the H. Oh my God, it's gonna be huge. Hmm, that's actually solid, man. I'm proud of that. I know this is way too big, but I got all the details right. I'll give mine a seven. I'll give mine a solid seven. If you guys want to rate my uh, my own drawings here, feel free to do it in the comments below. All right, I'm thinking we just knock out all the Canadian teams in this division right now, so let's go with Ottawa. Maybe I should just do their uh, alternate logo. 10 out of 10. Real talk though, I just drew an avocado. Seriously though, the actual Ottawa logo is going to be probably one of the most difficult. I'm just picturing the face. He's facing this way, if I'm not mistaken. That's the nose, the eye, there. Oh my God. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Wait, you, I know you can see both eyes, so let's go. I don't know what this little bump is. Maybe it's his eyebrows, sure. Okay, wait, he's got a helmet on. What am I doing? It's his nose. I don't know if he has ears. He's got the little, you know, the, the mohawk, no? I don't even want you guys to look at this. You know what? Done. That, that, that's as far as I'm gonna take it. I don't wanna make it any worse than it already is, so. There you go, guys, my Ottawa Senators logo. I'm sorry, Ottawa fans. I'm, I'm very, really, truly sorry. I've gotta pull it up now. It's just that bad. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh my God, not even close. Hey, you know the one thing I did get is he's looking 
this way in the logo, okay? That's pretty much the only detail that I got right. Um, yikes. All right, we're gonna try and stay local here. We'll go with the Buffalo Sabres. Again, this one should be fairly simple. There are a few details here, but uh, I know generally how the logo looks. So let's get into it. All right, so the first thing in any good Sabres logo is a nice little circle there. Now for the piece de resistance, the Buffalo. Give me one leg, give me another, yikes. Give me two more. Okay, give me a big buffalo head. Nope, that's, oh, okay, e sure. Yikes, this one is 10 times worse. Horn, eye, yes. I know it's got the little little accent thingy here, so let's go. I don't even know what these mean, but oh, I know they're there. Saber, number one, yikes. I hope they're pointing the right way. There we go. It's looking a little empty in this area. Oh, maybe it's N Y. All right, there you have it. Buffalo Sabres. Give it a five out of 10. Mm, more like a two. Still got a few more teams to go. Two Florida ones and Detroit and Boston. Oh gosh. Okay. You know what? Let's go with Boston. This one could be the easiest one so far. So again, starting off with a nice circle. That is a nice circle. That is a good second circle as well. Good follow up. Now we need the big, the big B, the big bad B. There, 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 there. Okay. Okay. And then we just got to do the spokes. That's about it. That's, that's what they call the B's logo. The spoked wheel, the, the spoke B, spoke wheel, whatever. So we got the spokes here. So we got one. This is all sorts of wacky. Seven, eight. Let's connect them. Make them look a little bit more professional here. And I think we're done. I know the B is small relative to the circle, okay? But the details are there. Did I at least get the number spokes right? I did eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight. Yeah, I did eight. And they're eight. Okay, so there we go. That's a good start. And then the B, there's also a secondary outline. It's yellow and black, not just one color. But you know, that's a solid attempt. Our right, last original six team in the Atlantic, Detroit Red Wings, obviously known as the winged wheel. Don't know all the little details, but it's a winged wheel. So if nothing else, let's just draw that. So we'll start with a circle here, and then a big circle here. It's like, it's a motorcycle tire, right? So, so it's the Motor City, so. Let's go. Oh, oh, hello. Oh. Promising. I uh, can't remember if there's a hood or not. Probably is like a hood to the, to the wheel. Okay. And then let's start the wing. So it's like that kind of, kind of, huh? Oh gosh. And then there's these little, pretty sure there are these, things look like sausages not that confident about this anymore that just looks odd okay sure another line here done this detail it's not you know doesn't look very good but it's like the feathers of the wing still ugly though there's only two more teams left and they're both the florida teams if it was the old florida logo this would have been a lot tougher but it's a new logo which is simplified a little bit and then they've also got Tampa bay logo which is possibly the easiest one. Let's start off with Florida and then let's end off on a good note, or we'll try. It's like, it's like that, at the here, and it's like that. It's like a shield kind of. I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure it's got these. Oh no, wait, did I just draw the Super Smash Bros logo? No, because it has, okay, hold on, hold on. It says Panthers. Right? Somewhere. Then we've got, let's draw the panther. Okay, okay. Gotta get those whiskers in. Um, I don't know what lion, panther eyes look like, so. We'll just go with like teardrops. Oh! I just drew a pig! <laughs> this is going kind of okay. And then I drew a pig. Dude. What have I done? No. You know, we're just gonna run with that. There's your Florida Pigs logo. Oh, dude, that wasn't even close. The only part I got right is the crest shape. That's the only part. It's totally wrong. It says Florida up at the top, not down the bottom or near the middle. The panther's looking the other way and it's actually looks like a panther. Dude, I, I messed that up so hard. Okay, but this is why I said I want to do Tampa last because it 
should be the easiest one. Okay, I know it's not, it's not a circle, it's like a ellipse shape. Okay, so far I'm happy. There's a secondary inside. Okay, the lightning bolt comes down outside, like so, comes back in a little bit, and then it goes out again, and then it goes in like that, in here, and out, and finish at the top. Look at that, attention to detail, and wait, no, I gotta fix that too. Yep, I kinda love that sound. Okay, there you go. Tampa Bay Lightning. Easy, easy. That looks pretty legit. I'm gonna give this one the highest rating of the video. This one's getting, this is getting a solid eight. All right guys, that about does it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop a like if you did. Feel free to try it out for yourself as well. And it is a lot harder than it looks. I'll warn you once again, try it out and send me your results on uh, Instagram or drop it in my Discord. Links are both below. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next few episodes where I'm going to do the other three divisions and maybe some other um, things. If you have any ideas what you know you want me to draw or just any other video ideas, feel free to leave them in the comments below guys. Subscribe for more videos and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.